Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving deep into Google Flow, Google's powerful suite of AI tools with a special focus on VEO3 for incredible video generation. Whether you're an educator, produce marketing copy, an interior designer, or just a creator looking to bring your visions to life. We'll explore how to use VEO3's different modes through both Flow and Gemini, along with its new image generating tool. By the end of this video, you'll have everything you need to create cinematic masterpieces. This is amazing. Whether you're brand new or already familiar, Google gives every user 100 free AI credits to get started. For this demo, I'm on a pro account, but on a free account, you'd see the 100 credit balance. Each VEO3 fast video costs 20 credits, so you can create up to five videos at no cost. The pro account gives you 1,000 credits per month with the Ultra at 25,000. Google now allows you to transfer credits between Flow and a new experimental tool whisk that lets you use images as prompts to visualize your ideas and tell your story. I did a tutorial video on WISC a couple months back. I'll leave a link in the description for anyone who wants to learn more about WISC. All right, log into your Gemini account and let's start with a quick text to video in VO. Gemini's tools just got an update, so it's the perfect place to begin. The first update you'll notice is the new image creation tool, Nano Banana, now built right into Flow. We'll check it out later, but in seconds, you can generate high resolution images of just about anything you imagine. There's even a canvas option with prompt suggestions to help you get started. And finally, Gemini's guided learning feature has been upgraded, so you can dive into practically any subject and teach yourself as you go. Really impressive if you haven't tried it yet. For this part, I'll demo how to create a video with VO. By default, it uses the VO3 fast model, which generates eight second clips. Basically, all you need to do is describe the scene you're looking for, and you can add an image or background music. Next, you can describe your video. I'll drop all the prompts from today's demo in the description so you can copy them. The more specific you are with your prompts, the better the results. What you think. This is amazing. Wow, let's watch that again in slow motion to catch the details. Pretty cool, right? This is amazing. I'd like to show you a couple more examples of what's possible. Let's start with one where floating black and white photos suddenly burst and transform into full color or a piano player blending into an ocean sunset? Let me know in the comments what you think. How about a coffee brand tagline, it's heavenly? The possibilities are endless if you really start thinking about it. And if you're like me, you like free options to test stuff out before spending any money. Now, let's dive into Google Flow. Once you're logged in, you can either pick up where you left off on an existing project or tap new project to start from scratch. That's exactly what we'll do. This is the prompt box where you can manage all your options and features. The model now gives you three choices, text to video, frames to video, and ingredients to video. We'll start with text to video. I'll enter my prompt in the toolbar. Once again, the more details you provide the model, the better the results. I've selected two animated outputs for our demo to showcase the range of this model. In this first example, we asked it to generate a bustling street market in a cyberpunk setting. With Flow, your videos are ready to watch the moment they're generated. No extra steps, no waiting. You can preview results instantly, make adjustments on the fly, and only download when you're ready. 
As we mentioned earlier, VO gives you several options, fast or quality, with or without sound. You can also choose how many outputs you want per prompt. I usually go with two at a time. And just to recap, each fast prompt costs 20 credits. They also mention that sometimes the sound may not work. So just keep that in mind when you're testing things out. That was the case with our video. No sound this time, but the attention to detail is still next level. What do you think? Now let's take that same animated street and reimagine it as a post-apocalyptic scene with overgrown ruins of the same street and matching sound design. The result is dark, eerie, and atmospheric. Pretty impressive, actually. Leave a comment. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Let's jump into frames to video. This is where things get really exciting for filmmakers. The ability to actually control camera angles. With VO, you can now select angles just by tapping the camera icon and you'll see a whole range of options to experiment with. You've got dolly in and out, orbit, pan, even tilt. Honestly, this is a total game changer. By tapping the plus sign, you can now generate your own images directly in Google Flow. We'll test it out shortly in the ingredients to video. Gemini also supports image generation, taking your text and references to instantly create visuals. So whether you're in Flow or Gemini, you've got powerful image creation. Uploading images into this model gives you the ability to blend them together and generate a really captivating video. In our example, I'll go ahead and upload my images. I've chosen two character shots that I want to merge into a fun promo style video. This is a great way to experiment and see how creative you can get. I'll enter our prompt and then let's sit back and watch the magic happen as the model brings the idea to life right in front of us. Zero to G. I ran it through Gemini as well. What do you think? Zero to G. Finally, let's take a look at the ingredients to video option. This one lets you mix and match generated images to create really dynamic eye-catching videos. Go ahead and tap the Generate Image tab and enter your prompt. We'll keep it simple and start with just a pair of sneakers. Let's see what it comes up with. Hit Use This Image, then go ahead and upload your next one. For this round, we're going with Fireworks. Once again, select this image and then enter your prompt. This time, we'll have Fireworks shooting from the steps behind. Flow can now even upscale your images at no extra cost. You'll get a notification once they're ready to download. Just imagine how this is about to revolutionize marketing, streamlining content creation, testing campaigns in real time, and opening up entirely new ways to connect and engage with audiences. If you found this tutorial helpful, please consider liking, leaving a comment, and sharing. It really helps the channel grow. I truly appreciate you watching, and as always. Keep exploring, keep creating. See you in the next one.